All right, what is going on, guys? Today we are watching Spice and Wolf episode nine. Uh, apologies, last week's episode wasn't on the channel. Um, I was away and then I got sick. So, yeah, I did watch it in my own time, though. It was a good episode. Uh, we were introduced to the shepherd Nora. She seems like a very sweet girl. I feel like Hollow was again just a teeny bit jealous about Lawrence potentially giving her uh, his some of his attention. Um, but she, she played it off cool. She was teasing him back as well, which was quite cute. Um, obviously, we all know uh, Hollow is the cutest. Um, but yeah, Nora seemed like a really nice character. Very sweet, very kind of like a, even a, like a heavenly aura. Obviously, she's very religious, of course. Um, and she hopefully will provide some business opportunities for Lawrence in the future. So that was cool. Um, but yeah, they made it to the new town or city. I forgot what the name is. Um, seems bustling. He got there and he was a bit confused as like the gate guards were like well confused by his the, the armor that he was bringing a mere like single trader bringing 20 sets of armor um and then yeah uh, he ended up going to the trading company he knew the guy there he was he referred to him as his son and um yeah apparently someone i think one of the town's guards came to the local trading company and was like give this message to lawrence if he uh, comes by so yeah, guess we'll see what's going to happen in this episode. As always, guys, if you're new to the channel, please hit that subscribe button and like the video as well. Uh, let's go into this episode right now. Oh, did he spot uh, Hollow? That's funny. Why? She's so good at her job. Mm, I suppose, the church influence. Ah, uh, yeah, the church are keeping an eye on her. That's why the priest was watching her when he when she came through last time. Oh, uh, yeah, they were like, they had no uh, customers or anything like that, did they? <laughs> he seems like a cool guy. Yeah, you're flirting with my girl? Get out of here. The one doing the saving. That's true, yep. <laughs> Oh, she overheard that, yeah? Wow. Oh, yeah. She's teasing him again. <laughs> oh, that's cute. She knows how to push his buttons, though. Is he going to leave the certificate with her? Oh, okay. The peaches. She always gets her way. I love these two. There's no, like, cliche, huge jealousy moments. They're just <laughs> back and forth teasing, but it's mostly Lawrence getting teased, so. Where's their angle with her, with her? Why are they trying to, like, put her in these situations? Because they know she can and they can earn money for her? Or he can earn money for them that way? She? I, I always get confused. Oh, he's draw, drew, drawn a, another illustration of his future shop. She eating a whole pie? She better get her honey pickled peaches before we leave the city. Quite unpleasant. Hmm. Yeah, gave him a little piece. There is no one at all. Anybody want to come out and get some items? They're just letting him go like that? What? They've ripped him off. Bruh. It's been cancelled? Oh my god, this sucks. Yeah! Fuck! He tried to set the other guy up as well. He's been bamboozled. Oh shit, now it's going to reflect on that merchant. Damn. These shady bastards. 
Where does he plan to sell the armor? Oh shit, he's panicking. Yeah, that makes sense. And plus it would, re would reflect on the merchant organization he's a part of as well. Yeah. How though? Damn. Respect, Hollow. But he'd still be done as a merchant if it came to that. <laughs> this girl is along for the ride, bro. She knows what she wants, and you're not getting away from her. Business part of partner works, I guess. Yeah. What is he what is he getting at here? I mean it was a solid plan. Well this expedition being cancelled screwed it. Makes sense. What can he help with then? You'll not have it tomorrow? Maybe in prison? For 10 years. Oh my god. Lawrence has good rep. So you can't trust him like this. Okay, so I guess the help he got from him was him being able to kind of reassure him. As well as saying, like, I'm not going to detain you straight away if you're not able to get the money. Is that... Is that it? That was the plan? Nobody wants to help him out? Bruh, is it because of the, the word of mouth? Everybody's aware of what's happening to him right now? He is not doing good at the moment. Bro! These fucking people, man. Like, he's not a reliable, trusting, per a trustworthy person. Oh, this is sad. Is this this guy gonna give him a break? Yeah, it wasn't his fault. Is he gonna help him? Bruh. Oh, he's going to be angry at her. Oh, come on, Lawrence. I get he's angry. He really has to do something here, but... Taking it on Hollow. He is really stuck between a rock and a hard place, though. This sucks. Right, so that was Spice and Wolf episode 9. Oh, that sucked so bad. I can't believe they did him like that. He better, he better, like, spread the word of, like, the fact that those people are cheating in that other city, like, with the tip table and whatnot. That is some bullshit. Um, yeah, it sucks the way the episode ends as well, with Hollow. God, I, und I understand his frustration, but he just, obviously, he didn't want to, like, go off on uh, Hollow like that as well, so... Yeah, I hope this resolves neatly, hopefully in the next episode. I hope he's able to get his own back and he's able to sell the armor well and get a good price for them. I just don't know how, how he's going to get out of this situation. Um, but yeah, overall, very good episode and I'm definitely looking forward to the next. I want to thank you guys so much for watching my reaction today. Have an interesting day and peace out.